We've all been making the most of outdoor public spaces over the past year, but it seems we've been forgetting to do our bit to keep them tidy. Figures show councils are having to spend millions to clear up parks and beaches, as well as volunteers like these giving up their time. It is a real issue. It does affect in the short, medium and long term the environment. Um, and it's a very simple thing to do the right thing. So I, I do feel it's, it sort of feels to, it belongs to another era. The increase in waste has led to a rise in call-outs for the RSPCA. In England and Wales, they treated almost 4,000 animals affected by litter in 2020. Here at their wildlife centre in Norfolk, this cygnet's foot was injured by a discarded fishing hook. But even simple things like plastic bags can cause serious injuries to seals like Noki. Well, Noki is behind us, I hope, and um, he actually had this little slither of plastic around him, which is a tiny part of a, a bin bag. And it's, it looks innocuous and looks like nothing, but unfortunately it's cut right into his neck. And as soon as they get things over their heads, seal's anatomy means they can't do that, so they can't push it off their head. They get larger. Whatever it is around their neck digs in more and more, causing a, a bigger wound and more infection, and on it goes until eventually it will kill them. Mrs Vickers' injuries from a plastic ring are so severe, she's having to be kept separate. So if you got anything like this for your dog, please don't take it to the beach. Um, don't even think about playing it with it next to water, because once it's in the water, it's there forever and it's not going to degrade. So please take it away with you, or don't take it there at all. It'll be a few more months until they can attempt to release Mrs Vickers back into the wild. Aside from her injuries, the plastic has left her underweight. Oh, that's just caught around. At a time when the RSPCA, like many charities, are struggling with funding, we can all play our part in stopping animals ending up in their care by binning and recycling our waste properly. Vincent McAvinney, 5 News.